Hello everyone, this is Arch from Fangs, and welcome to another video of Terraria. So in the last video we actually did some home improvements to our base. It's basically like another video of me expanding my base, like a part 2. I uh, made out of brick and ice brick. So I'm trying to try with new stuff, like I said, I'm experimenting with new stuff. So yeah, also... When I was grinding the stuff for the farming video, because today's video is going to make a gardening video. And two new NPCs arrive. The engineer, who sells wrenches, switches, a wire cutter with wire, and then pressure plates, and a booster track, and actuator. So basically you use her for like to make traps or anything. You can, Some statues will spawn enemies. But the only downside is they, they will not drop their loot. So yeah. I could make a fish statue and it will spawn a lot of golden fish. I could make us get some stars for mana regeneration. Hearts, which I don't have a heart um, statue. Will give you hearts. A bunny statue will spawn bunnies. Stuff like that. Also, not all the statues are can be activated with switches. So only a few. And this guy is the other NPC, his name is a Clothier guy. Um, he sells black thread, pink thread, summer hat, familiar shirt, familiar pants, familiar wig. So yeah, so so far his, their names are Graham, the Clothier, and Sophia the Mechanic, the Engineer. Oh well. So yeah, we did that. So in today's video we're going to do a gardening. One thing I wanted to know is I had to go to another world to get the water leaf seeds. Basically, it was another world I created. It's just like the beginning of it. I haven't even thought that I have Doohu with that character that I created for that world. And I had like 10 seeds there. So I just like to took 10 water leaf seeds. And I'm going to use them right here. Because so far, these seeds can only be obtained while raining. And it has not rained in my world for a while. It did rain a few couple parts ago but I did not got the seeds then but yeah without further ado let's work on making our garden expansion we actually did a part like a small farm video a while ago but today's gonna be the one we're gonna use for our final video so yeah so we're gonna make it out of I don't know my favorite brick is actually the gray brick but I could think of making it into actually you know what let's make it out of mud brick so yeah, that would be nice. So let's do that. First of all, the reason why I have mud brick or mud blocks right here is because I want to make a a blue mushroom farm or a glowing mushroom. Yeah. And I want to... Can I make it here though? And you need 200 blocks to get it. Um, to able to make it uh, as a biome ish. Okay, now where are the bricks? There you go, mud stone brick. Oh, I need cobblestone, the stone thingy. Oh well, let's take a few from here. This garden does not need to have a wall, so I'm not gonna make a wall. So yeah. If you're like wondering like oh if I'm gonna use a wall, nope, I'm not gonna make a wall. So I'm gonna make a growing mushroom biome. You need at least 200 bucks to make a new biome so far. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take away these pots. And with the platform along with it. I wanna make 10 pots per herb. So yeah, and there you go. So we're gonna get our mar our mustard break. We're gonna head over here. I'm thinking of building on next to my base, so it's not too far away. So so far I need some space. So we're gonna start like over here. Okay, where are my platforms at? Like right here will be a nice. I'm gonna just go up here. Let's make it by five wide. 
This is where the Mustang Bring will start. Right there, and then I'm gonna open. I'm gonna make it like I did over here, the little platform right there. So we're gonna do one, two, three, and then this right here. It looks ugly, doesn't it? Oh, look, it, looks, it looks cool if I do a double layer. Oh, well, I'm just gonna use it like that. Okay, so so far I want to make the rows out of one, two, three, four. So like this. I'm gonna be one, two, three, four. 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 Okay, so so far we have what we have. So I'm gonna span it. So we're gonna make it by 10 pots. So I gotta start my first pot. Oh, actually, it's gonna be like this. I already messed up already. So I have the pots. Let me make it bigger. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's gonna be this big. Because it's gonna be ten pots, so there's no need for me to make it way bigger. And my first playthrough I actually had um like over 20 blocks. All right, let's continue going up. And I had it also five by the open instead of four. So yeah. So I think this should be like the last row. One, two, three, four. There you go. Now let's light it up. Now let's get the seeds. So we're gonna need to make more pots. So I don't think we have a lot of seeds on me. Okay, I need ten shiver seeds. I need ten moon glow seeds, and I need ten day bloom seeds, and I bought the ten water leaf seeds. What else am I missing? Bring roots. I don't have any blink root seeds. 
I don't have any bling group seats. I need to go get some. For deck we, I don't know how you grow deck we. I don't really know how to grow it. I don't know. I don't think you can grow it with the plants. I'll try and see. I think you can. Let me just get this seed. So we're gonna need more pots. So we're gonna need 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60 pots. Uh, and additional 10 for the pink roots, which I don't have at the moment. And it's 60. There's 65 because I wanna have some extras. All right, so let's go right here. Let's get the first one. Gonna be Daybloom. I want Daybloom to be the first. Like that. The next here will be Night, the Moonglow one. Alright, and then the second one, the third layer will be Water Leaf. The Water Leaf, once again, can only be obtained to rain. There you go. And then this one will be Shiver Thorn. Now that I'm thinking about it, I'm going to need to make two more layers. Two more layers because I need to make the blink root ones. Actually, one more layer, not two more layers. We could do that. Let's do that right now. Right here. Do it. So three, one, two, three. There you go. This, this one's gonna be the blink roots, which I don't have at the moment. I go get it. Maybe if I'm really intent, I'll go get them. And this will be the crimson one. Get that wheat. Unfortunately, fire blossom will be really hard to do. Can I plant them here? Oh, yeah, I can't. I can't. So that sucks. For now, it's gonna be that. Alright, so since I got some remaining time, let's go look for the bing root seeds. Well, actually, I still need to make them my mushroom farm. Let's see, I think we could make some, we could find some quickly, and we find some right here. As long as I get like about three, that will be fine. Ah, uh, that's my area. Come on, come on, they spawn on dirt. So, they don't just see one. Nope. There you go. I got three blink root seeds. Now, where's the rest? Can seem to find me some, so let's just go back to base. We're gonna just use those three seeds we got to grow. There you go, we did it. And now for the glowing mushroom biome, I'm gonna go somewhere very high, not too high. 
Somewhere like maybe above my base could be fine. We're gonna go very high, so I'm gonna need dirt. I'm gonna go up here. I'm gonna do this one more way my base. Like right here should be it. Like right here. So let's start by planting this. So you just do a big giant line of 200 blocks to make a biome. Ah, uh, do you need, need, no, you don't need, you need, need a hungry blocks, I think. I think. Yeah, I think that's it for now. Light it up. Shit, man, I can kill that thing. Alright. So, we're gonna double this layer. Ooh, we have zombies up here now. So I'm gonna do it again, and we're gonna go this way. Alright, so to make the mushroom farm, oh, not that. Just get rid of this going on. All I need to do is get the, uh, oh, I don't have the seeds. I do not have the seeds. And this one, mushroom grass seeds. And you basically place it on the... And the mud block and you're good to go. Like this. And where is it at? Right here. Right there. I need a faster spreading. Just give us some time and then we'll spread. Actually you don't need that many torches. There you go. Let's check out our garden roots. We got two day bloom. So I'm not gonna farm that because oh we got blink roots already. Nice. Damn they go fast. So now I can start making my own potion farm and all that kind of stuff. So anyways guys, it will be it for this video. If you enjoy me making a garden farm and making my mushroom farm. Hopefully it's enough to make it. Because uh, I read online that you need to have at least 200 blocks of that to make a biome. Look, it's already spreading. Uh, the Pacific block to make a biome so far. Supposed to be like at least screen wide. Yeah, it should be fine. If it's not, then I'll extend it by adding more blocks to it later on in the future. So yeah, and hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. If you're new to my channel, subscribe. Especially if you enjoy my content. 
subscribe if you want to see more gameplays or stuff like that in the future and if you got any comments or questions or you want to say anything about my channel or about the game questions about it then you're welcome to leave them down in the comments below and as always this is Archer Fangs. i'll see you next time thank you for watching bye